Hi, my name is Cliff Hansen, and it's cold outside. I uh, am recording this podcast on my walk to work because um, I wanted to, you to get a view of this climate outside. Someone broke into my mom's car yesterday, and they stole her coat, her boots, and a sleeping bag. All things that keep one warm. I, I, I can't even imagine actually living outside and I, I'm so close to the edge myself that I don't know what I would do so I bring this up because we need politicians that get that not people that can misplace what was it 10 or 100 million dollars not people that leave the White House and have several houses and complain about how broke they were no, we need people that actually understand what it is to be on food stamps. I'm walking about a mile in the cold, in the snow, for a minimum wage job, and I do this every day. I'm a lucky person. I'm a lucky one. There are people far, far worse off than I am. And we need politicians that can look from that perspective. So we're starting up a new party called the Justice Democrats. It's a hostile takeover of the Democratic Party because they just don't get it anymore. Maybe they never did. There have been a lot of a lot of good things that have come from the Democratic Party. A lot of union rights that we take for granted every day. But look at them now. Chuck Schumer, who every day is, you read an article about how he's being hailed as this new resistance hero. Well, I believe, and I may be mistaken on this, but at the time I'm recording, I believe he's voted in support of every single one of Trump's nominees, including Pompeo, who is in favor of torture. How is that democratic? He's not going to go in the history books with a D next to his name. It's going to say collaborator. Elizabeth Warren, I like Elizabeth Warren, she's done so much good, but she's voted to confirm sleepy boy Ben Carson, who believes <laughs> that the Egyptians built, built the pyramids to fill them with grain. I mean, that, how is he the most qualified person for the job? I'll tell you who's a better person for the job. Someone who's actually faced housing discrimination. Someone who's actually experienced these issues. Maybe he's had one or two issues here or there, but Carson, not the right guy for the job. And I cannot remotely think he's the only person qualified for it, let alone the best. So we don't have Schumer fighting for the American people. We don't have Elizabeth Warren even. It's just us. Just as Democrats. It was meant to be more dramatic and then I started walking through an icy puddle. <laughs> so we're going to be doing this podcast and our goal is going to be to find people across America who can take over people that will represent who we really are people that are going to swear an oath that you're not going to take big money you're not going to become a corporate cor corrupt tool like Howard Dean did when he started taking money and became a lobbyist we are trying to actually get something done because the clock is ticking. We need results and as many great ideas as the Greens and Social Dems have, we're not achieving those results because it's so stacked against third parties. So we are going to continue fighting for those progressive ideas, but we have no choice but to do it through the Democratic platform so we're going to take over the democratic platform
Well, we'll talk a lot more about this later, but my hands are really, really cold right now and I have to get to work. So we'll get this podcast out soon. And until then, stay safe, stay smart, and we can make a difference.